How's it going, everybody? My name is Joe, and I'm going to be reacting to Young Justice Season 4, Episode 15. And before we continue, please subscribe to the channel and like the video. Here with Clark, cool. And who are you? This thing? Uh, we're not confused. Uh, we okay. do need your help. And your report, Lagon? I wish I had better news, Alex. There's unrest in nearly every city state, particularly in Zabo. Yes. <laughs> Something. Anyway, what choice do we better have? Better than nothing. You know. Going one random direction. Admitting we're actually dead. <laughs> what the heck is that? <laughs> Look like a Pokemon. Well, the of course, they call it the stranger. Shall herald seas that bring red death. So, <laughs> first condition of the prophecy seems to have been met. What? A... Is like during the child attack. <laughs> okay. Oh, it was then. Okay, interesting. We came back to your era to prevent a disaster. The death of Superboy. We did save his life outside the UN a year ago. Our time sphere was destroyed. We're oh, yeah. stranded here now. A star friend in the same explosion that killed Superboy. So a second was that the girl that's with him? Yeah, one of the ships. Oh. Oh. But she doesn't believe she's getting squished. She should be okay. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> He's my best friend. Go, go, go. We need you to be in Happy Harbor, Rhode Island, ten years from today at twelve noon exactly. Is it a rubber there? Do what? As so when the time comes, ask yourself, what would Superboy do? The way. Black Lightning to Superman. We're facing a global mystic crisis. I wonder if we'll be able to see that ten years from now. Uh, together then. Uh, agreed. <laughs> oh. A three will rise, restoring breath when best of these gains Arian's crown. Prophecy. Prophecy. Stranger. Who is this? Jeez. Oh. You will regret this, brother. All right, where's the stranger? Don't tell me he left. Ten days gone by. I was called uh. Arian. Arian? Arian, Lord of Atlantis. Okay, makes sense. Arian. Arian. Harry. I like that twist. Kid Flash, we need to talk. No way. Going to Wally, younger Wally, and they went back in time. Our focus must turn to Project Threeness. As of now, it is our sole priority. Project Threeness. Alrighty, that was episode 15 of Young Justice. That was a pretty good episode there. It was cool kind of getting the Atlanteans perspective of them going through the child crisis that was going on. We saw Dr. Fate and crew kind of go in and out um, as they were teleporting between the different places, as we saw in the those previous episodes. But here, seeing Calder and Mira taking on this fire tornado thing. Also, with the help of Orm here, kind of cool seeing them team up. But obviously, he couldn't trust Orm. You know, he was going to turn on them. But as we saw, the third person, the prophecy coming to fruition. And at the time, I didn't know who it could have been. But it definitely makes sense why it would be Arian, the son of Vandal Savage. He would be a very valuable person to be on our side in the fight against Vandal Savage. That would be a pretty cool fight to see if that comes to fruition. Because, yeah, we definitely learned what happened to the sun and how he just got disrespected with 
losing his people, his city, himself. We all thought he died, but in reality, he did not. It is very weird that he barely showed himself now, you know? So I definitely wonder what he's been doing in between what happened with the initial collapse of Atlantis to what it is today. But with his help, I think it is only going to be for the better. And with the way that he was beloved, I think Aquaman would step down and let Arian rule because, yeah, he is the founder of Atlantis. But we'll see. I'm hoping there's no butting heads. But I do like this twist here. Definitely made this storyline more interesting from last episode. I was kind of meh. But this, along with just the stuff that's going on with Connor, there really wasn't much here. It just stuck. sucks that he is stuck in whatever realm or plane this is. But it was cool to see those future travelers. I don't know. They have this beloved love for Superboy. And now they need the help of Clark to take his place 10 years from now at Happy Harbor. I wonder what that is, what that means, what goes on during that time period. I definitely hope we get to see that. But now we know the girl that's with Superboy was one of the three that was with these future travelers. So definitely makes sense. Thank you, the Young Justice team here for clarifying. Because I was, I was like, yeah, who who is this person? But other than that, I think that's all I have. If you have any questions or theories, please leave in the comment section below. My boy, Joey, is the editor for this video. And if you're in need of an editor, please check out the description below and his email will be there. If you enjoyed the reaction, please like the video, subscribe, and I'll see you on the next one.